Have you ever wondered what would happen if humans were given the power to travel at the speed of light? Imagine this. You're standing on Earth, and the entire universe stretches before you. Millions of stars, billions of planets, countless galaxies, and you set out to see them all with your own eyes. No spaceship needed, no fuel shortage, just the ability to take off in an instant. So let's embark on this journey of imagination today, and find out how long it would take to reach the planets and stars of the universe if we traveled at the speed of light. Let's start from home, from Earth to the Sun. We all know that the Sun is approximately 149.6 million kilometers away. If we travel at the speed of light, which is approximately 300,000 kilometers per second, it would take us just 8 minutes and 19 seconds to reach the Sun. Meaning, if you leave Earth and fly like light, after 8 minutes you'll be standing in front of the Sun's fiery glow. Now let's move on to Mercury. The distance between Earth and Mercury is approximately 77 million kilometers. If you travel at the speed of light, it will take only 4 minutes and 12 seconds to reach there. Now let's move on to Venus. Venus is approximately 100 million kilometers from Earth. If you travel at the speed of light, you'll reach there in just 5 minutes and 35 seconds. Now our next destination, Mars. The average distance between Earth and Mars is about 225 million kilometers. So, at the speed of light, it would take 12 minutes and 30 seconds to reach there. Now let's head to Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system. It's about 778 million kilometers away. If you fly at the speed of light, it would take 43 minutes to reach there. Now let's move on to Saturn. Its distance from Earth is approximately 1.43 billion kilometers. This means that if we travel at the speed of light, it would take 1 hour and 19 minutes. Next comes Uranus, a cold blue, gaseous planet 2.87 billion kilometers from Earth. At the speed of light, it would take 2 hours and 40 minutes to reach there. Now let's head to Neptune. It's the farthest major planet from the Sun, at a distance of approximately 4.5 billion kilometers. If you travel at the speed of light, it would take 4 hours and 10 minutes to reach there. But wait, our journey doesn't end there, because the universe isn't just our solar system. The nearest star to the Sun is Proxima Centauri, which is 4.24 light years away. If you travel at the speed of light, it would take 4 years and 3 months to reach there. And if you wanted to travel the entire observable universe, it would take you approximately 292 billion years. Yes, you heard that right, 292 billion years. Our universe is only 13.8 billion years old. This means that even if you travel at the speed of light, you'll only be able to reach a small part of the universe, because the universe is constantly expanding, and its boundaries are moving further away every second.